Very soon after the iPhone X launched with its notch screen, some Android phone makers started producing really similar phones. Devices like the Xiaomi Mi 8 and the Vivo V9 had similarly notch screens, but there were some minor differences like the notch might be a little bit smaller or the phone would be a little bit thinner. But now we've got the Moto P30, a phone for the Chinese market that looks exactly like the iPhone X, save for a slightly thicker lower bezel with the Motorola logo on it. This phone is a very blatant ripoff of the iPhone X. In fact, Motorola went so far as to give the screen a wallpaper that looks exactly like Apple's default wallpaper for the iPhone X. On the back of the phone, things also look really similar to Apple's iPhone. You've got the same raised, pill-shaped pod housing the two cameras in a flash module. The only big difference is that instead of the familiar Apple logo that you'd find on the back of the iPhone X, the P30 features a round Motorola logo that also doubles the fingerprint sensor. It's actually pretty funny because on the official page for this phone, Motorola actually points it out that they have a unique Motorola logo on the back, and they say something about good design being all about the details, but literally this is the only thing on the phone that is different from the iPhone X when you look at the back. Even the color options are really similar to those for the iPhone X, and if you opt for the most unique color variant, which is like an Aurora Blue, that is actually pretty much a ripoff of the Huawei P20's iridescent twilight paint job, so even their Motorola is pretty much copying another phone. On the specs front, the Motorola P30 really isn't that interesting. It's powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 636 processor that's paired with 6GB of RAM. You can opt for either 64 or 128GB of internal storage, and the display measures 6.2 inches. But honestly, it's just a very standard Android phone, and the most impressive things about this phone are just how shameless a copy of the iPhone X it really is. If you actually are interested in getting this phone, maybe as a joke, or maybe just you want an Android version of the iPhone X, it's arriving on September the 15th, and the main selling point for this phone, the reason why you're actually going to choose it as opposed to any other handset, is just that it's pretty cheap. The iPhone X starts at upwards of $1,000, this phone starts at $300 for 64GB of storage, or $360 for 128GB of storage. It comes in three different color variants, there's black, white, and the aforementioned Aurora color, so if you are interested in getting this phone, that's pretty much all there is to it. It. It's pretty funny. Honestly, normally I wouldn't cover a phone like this at all on my channel because just it's such a blatant ripoff of the iPhone. But the reason why I just wanted to mention this in this video is, you know, people always accuse, say, Samsung of copying Apple or LG of copying Apple when they have somewhat similar features. But I just kind of wanted to give you an idea of what a phone that's just a blatant ripoff actually looks like. Maybe to redeem some bigger Android companies just a little bit. But with that said, give me your opinions on this phone in the comment section down below. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and make sure to click the bell to get notified when I post new videos, and with that said, I will see you next time.